This particular piece is called a bentonite pottery, and it is a style of pottery that was developed in the early 30s as a way of uh, promoting North Dakota clay uh, and the resources in Western North Dakota. This particular piece was given uh, to the Fine Arts Club of Fargo, who is the one donating it to us today. They were given it as a gift from the North Dakota Federation of Women's Clubs. They were very active during the 20s and 30s, and um, they were given some money for a centerpiece for their clubhouse. And this is the piece that has been in their clubhouse ever since 1933. An incredible piece of pottery made by an outstanding North Dakotan, an outstanding woman, an outstanding philanthropist, Margaret Kelly Cable. We chose to donate it to the University of North Dakota so that it is home back at the campus that it started from. Margaret Cable started teaching from 1910 through 1949. This piece was, was given to the Fine Arts Club of Fargo for $10.50. Uh, presently, uh, estimates are uh, upwards of $20,000 that it's worth. On the bottom, it has the seal of North, University of North Dakota and the School of Mines. This piece was made from clay that was dug out in western North Dakota and the glaze, the bentonite glaze, is also a product of western North Dakota. Oh, I think it's great that it's so accessible that people can see it. Um, we wondered if it would be just stored away someplace and brought out for a special occasion, so we're thrilled that it will be here and people will be able to enjoy it along with all of its relatives in this display case. As the director of University of North Dakota Art Collections, I'm always delighted whenever the university receives such wonderful gifts as what we've received today with the bison rays. Uh, but I want to really point out uh, how much effort I know my colleague Don Miller has put into uh, building the collection, building the cable collection. And um, I really think that this is a day of celebration for him as well as the University of North Dakota.